Uh, a Private War is the story of Marie Colvin. Uh, it's a true story. Uh, she was a, a correspondent, war correspondent for the Sunday Times. Uh, and it's about that sort of addiction to covering war and what that did to her personally, uh, mentally, and, and physically. This, this story is deeply personal to me. You know, my background is in documentary films. Um, and, you know, I've been in dangerous situations before. And, and so uh, I very much empathized with this character, Marie Colvin, um, uh, and what she stood for and, and her desire to sort of put a human face to conflicts around the world. And uh, yeah, when I first heard about the, when I first read the script um, and heard about the possibility of making this film, I just knew that this was a, f a film that I had to make. It was amazing working with Rosamund Pike. She, she you know, was extraordinary uh, in the film and, and you know, we both worked really hard together um, to, to research the role and, and, and she did just an astounding job at, at embodying this deeply courageous, complicated, beautiful woman um, with, with amazing detail. Um, and, and, you know, so many people, uh, it's hard to distinguish uh, even her accent at the end of the movie between the real Marie and, and, and Rosamund. So it was an amazing experience working with her. And um, yeah, I think she did an incredible job. The festival's been amazing. I've, I've obviously heard amazing things about it for many, many years. I've never been able to come here with a film. So I'm just grateful to be here. Um, and yeah, just excited to be part of this community. I'm just really humbled and honored to receive that award and um, that I'm here and with the film and uh, yeah, just excited to share it with the world and see how people react. So find a story that, that you care about, find a story that, that, you, that moves you. Um, obviously the world has changed immensely over the past decade. Uh, you know, the ability to um, tell stories has been democratized with you know, cheap film equipment and uh, the avenues of distribution have been democratized. There's so many ways to get your films out there. Um, so I think it's an incredibly t exciting time to be making films, incredibly exciting time to be making documentary films. Um, so yeah, I feel just really lucky to be able to do what I do.